Hello everyone, welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. Today we are going to solve another interesting integral. Integral from 0 to infinity x times sine of x over 1 plus x square dx. Well, uh, for this integral, uh, I am going to use uh, the Laplace transform. So, let's uh, try to solve. Um, first, I am going to define a function f of t f of t is equal to integral from 0 to infinity x times sine of x t over 1 plus x square d x. Okay, then uh, we know the definition of Laplace transform. Laplace transform of f of t f of t uh, is equal to integral from 0 to infinity e to the minus s t times f of t d t. Well, uh, then I am going to take uh, the Laplace transform of f of t here. Laplace uh, transform of f of t is equal to, now we know the definition of Laplace transform of f of t. So, here we have integral from 0 to infinity. So, uh, 0 to infinity then we know here f of t so our f of t is equal to this integral so we have uh, integral from 0 to infinity x times sine of x t over 1 plus x square uh, dx then we know here e to the minus s t so e to the minus s t times d t okay then uh, here we have integral from 0 to infinity then uh, i am going to take uh, the laplace trans transform of sine of xt so we know laplace transform of sine of xt we can represent as uh, integral from 0 to infinity e to the minus st times sine of t dt so uh, here now we have here x so x then e to the minus s t times sine of x t integral from 0 to infinity sine of x t times e to the minus s t uh, dt we know uh, laplace transform of sine of x t so we can write here laplace transform of sine of x t over 1 plus x square dx okay then we know laplace transform of sine of x t is equal to x over x square plus x square okay then <coughs> we can apply laplace transform of sine of x t to our integral so we have integral from 0 to infinity uh, here x now laplace transform of sine of x t x over x square plus s square so x here x here x so we have x square over 1 plus x square times here uh, s square plus x square dx okay then uh, let's find the uh, partial fraction so to find the partial fraction decomposition we can uh, use Mm, here parenthesis we can use uh, cover method so here 0 to infinity first i am going to take uh, 1 plus x square so 1 plus x square then we should plug in uh, instead of x square we should plug in minus 1 so here we have minus 1 here uh, x square minus 1 okay then uh, plus now I am going to take x square plus x square uh, now we should plug in uh, instead of x square minus x square so here minus x square here 1 minus x square dx okay then uh, we can simplify at the same time uh, we can break our integral into two different integrals so here we know uh, 1 over s square minus 1 is a common factor too. So we can take outside of the integral sign. At the same time, 
we can multiply by minus sign both numerator and denominator so we have 1 over 1 minus a square integral from 0 to infinity dx over 1 plus x square then uh, here minus a square over 1 minus a square integral from 0 to infinity dx over x square plus x square <coughs> okay then we can integrate uh, here 1 over 1 minus a square times we know uh, this integral arctan so we have arctan of x from 0 to infinity minus here we have a square over 1 minus a square times uh, now this integral we know 1 over s times arctan of x over s uh, limit from 0 to infinity now if we apply limit uh, arctan of infinity we know pi over 2 lower limit arctan of 0 we know 0 so we have 1 over 1 minus s square times pi over 2 minus this s this 2 get cancelled here s over 1 minus s square times again arctan of infinity we know pi over 2 also arctan of 0 we know 0 okay then uh, we know here uh, pi over 2 common factor uh, then here 1 minus s square here 1 minus s uh, then we know uh, 1 minus s get cancelled because the denominator uh, we know difference of 2 squared 1 minus s times 1 plus s therefore 1 minus s get cancelled so we have pi over 2 times 1 over 1 plus s now we know uh, this is equal to uh, Laplace transform of f of t Laplace transform of f of t then we can isolate the f of t by taking inverse Laplace so f of t is equal to pi over 2 times inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s plus 1 we know 1 over inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s plus 1 is equal to e to the minus t so pi over 2 times e to the minus t uh, and we know this is equal to f of t then uh, f of t uh, our defined function f of t we know uh, this integral so uh, f of t is equal to integral from 0 to infinity x times sin of x t over 1 plus x square dx and this is equal to pi over 2 times e to the minus t now uh, let's fog in 1 uh, for t so f of 1 is equal to our integral x times sin of x over 1 plus x square dx and we know this is equal to pi e to the minus 1 so we can write 1 over e so pi over 2 times e okay this is the answer for this integral so we solve by using laplace transform okay thank you for watching